the A7 Avant is being developed as a successor to the Audi A6 Avant. It is expected to go on sale in 2025, and will feature design changes and technological improvements while retaining the internal combustion engine. Audi will introduce a new naming strategy to differentiate between engine cars and EVs. The former will be given an odd number and the latter an even number, and the next generation engine car, which is equivalent to the current A6, will be called the A7. The A6 name will be used next year for the A6 e-tron, an EV model based on Audi's new platform PPE. This time, a prototype A7 Avant was spotted testing on public roads in Germany. The front features slim headlights, Audi's traditional hexagonal radiator grille, and a streamlined bonnet. The aluminum wheel design has also been changed, the door handles are now flush style, and the rear is equipped with a full width light bar and a new two-piece muffler. We don't yet know the engine lineup, but the prototype scene has a yellow warning sticker on the window, indicating that it has some kind of electric assist. The platform will continue to be Volkswagen Group's MLB, but the rear structure will be changed to accommodate a lithium-ion battery for FEVs. Due to partial electrification, it is expected to be larger than the current model. For reference, the body size of the current A6 Avant is 4940mm in total length. 1,885 mm in total width, and 1,465 mm in total height. Alongside the A7 Avant station wagon, the A7 Sportback will also be released. These two cars will be rivals to the BMW 5 Series and Mercedes-Benz E-Class.